how delightful to actually meet you after all this time. You've been quite the obstacle. Where, where am I? So capable, so young. You are in the hands of God, of course. Here, his faithful servant stands vigilant, and the delusional are brought to be enlightened. You have been destined to come here. What are you talking about? Who are you? I am the architect of this epidemic that creeps across the lands, ridding them of sin. You are the one responsible for all of this? The one who sends thousands to the graves? Yes, the Black Death. Why? Why would you do this? Mankind has been allowed to revel in their sinful ways for far too long. And once reprisal is close at hand, they grovel before the holy men who grants them absolution. Despicable! How could any man who claims to be a member of God's church grant such vermin respite? It is blasphemy! Everywhere I turn, sinners meet my case. A corrupting darkness festers within their minds, enslaving them to the vices of the wine, the coin, and the ruin of war. Hmm. But all is not lost. There are those, like myself, who have taken certain steps to ensure that such acts will plague us no longer. For years we have gathered in secrecy, waiting for the Lord to help us end this age of corruption and lead us to a new era. There will be no unclean souls left to walk this earth. By the Lord's help, we have seen to that. What madness is this that you preach? You have let a disease loose upon the world that will see us all destroyed. Only those who have sinned in the eyes of God will suffer that fate. Do you honestly believe that this disease chooses its victims based on faith? You're evil. Your soul has been tainted. Naive child. Speak not of things you do not understand. My soul shines with only the purest of intent. You know nothing of the struggle against sin, against the darkness. Your mind is clouded by madness. I see those people for what they truly are. Opportunists who suckle and grow fat on their own lies. That is the source of true disease. Not the decay of flesh. True disease spreads from the heart. But I will end this. I shall stand amongst those faithful enough to survive this plague and emerge as the Lord's chosen saviour. Now you know the truth, and your judgment awaits. You have proven quite capable in your misguided attempt to sabotage our work. That is a felony punishable by death. However, I can save you from that fate if you confess your sins and join us. Join you? You expect me to cast away all that I worked for and let you walk free? Perhaps I need to persuade you further. Here, the ancient relic of the lost saint, buried deep within the catacombs of old Jerusalem, retrieved by the Templar Brotherhood and locked away for its deadly touch. 
and now this God-given artifact lies in my hands. Behold the source of our... <gasps> How delightful to actually meet you. After all this time, you've been quite the obstacle. Where am I? So capable, so young. You are in the hands of God, of course. He, his faithful servant, stands vigilant. And the delusional are brought to be enlightened. You have been destined to come here. What are you talking about? Who are you? I am the architect of this epidemic that creeps across the lands, ridding them of sin. You are the one responsible for all of this? The one who sent thousands to the graves? Yes, the Black Death. Why? Why would you do this? Mankind has been allowed to revel in their sinful ways for far too long. Once reprisal is close at hand, they grovel before the holy men who grant them absolution. Despicable! And how could any man who claims to be a member of God's church grant such vermin respite? Everywhere I turn, sinners meet my gaze. A corrupting darkness festers within their minds, enslaving them to the vices of the wine, the coin, and the ruin of war. But all is not lost. There are those, like myself, who have taken certain steps to ensure that such acts will plague us no longer. For years we have gathered in secrecy, waiting for the Lord to help us end this age of corruption and lead us to a new era. What madness is this that you preach? You have let a disease loose upon the world that we see us all destroyed. You're evil. Your soul has been tainted. Only those who have sinned in the eyes of God will suffer that fate. Your mind is clouded by madness. Naive child. I see those people for what they truly are. Opportunists who suckle and grow fat on their own lies. That is the source of true disease, not the decay of flesh. True disease spreads from the heart. But I will end this. I shall stand amongst those faithful enough to survive this plague and emerge as the Lord's chosen savior. Now you know the truth and your judgment awaits. You have proven quite capable in your misguided attempt to sabotage our work. And that is a felony punishable by death. However, I can save you from that fate, if you confess your sins and join us. Join you? 
You expect me to cast away all that I worked for and let you walk free? Perhaps I need to persuade you further. Here, the ancient artifact of the lost saint. Buried deep within the catacombs of old Jerusalem and locked away for its deadly touch. Behold, the source of our... No! No! 